We're here with Wes Isley, a magician and illusionist, and we can't wait to see him work his magic for us, but he also does something called a Magic of Giving Project. Yeah, he's been doing it for a few years in order to raise money for the Children's Miracle Network, and he's here today to tell us all about it. Thank you so much for coming on. Thanks for having me, guys. This yes, is awesome. I this love it. Yeah, great. And you definitely just blew our minds right before we came on. Yes, you he showed did. us a trick just to get warmed up. You guys, he's really good. I'm really excited <laughs> about this. So let's start with how did you get started with magic and illusions? Oh boy, I've been doing magic since I was seven years old. I wanted to do movie magic, uh -huh. and I was all set to go to Art Institute of Pennsylvania, and Terminator 2 came out when I was in high school. So now it's all CGI. And I'm like, I can't sit behind a desk. Yeah. I have to go, go, go. Right. So I wanted a job where I could be on the road, and I always liked magic, but I thought it was like musicians where your band is struggling. Mm -hmm. So I got a degree in marketing and it's been magic ever since, 22 years on the road with my family. That's amazing and you do take your family out on the road. That's such a great little family act you guys have going. Is there a trick to getting started with magic or illusion? Is there somewhere to go with, if someone out there is interested? You know, there, everybody goes to YouTube but that's probably one of the worst places to go because a 12 okay. year old tells you this is how it's done and he has no performance background Good or, advice. you know, so yeah. a library is really the best place to go. Get an old book on magic where the, a professional has written the book and will tell you step by step how Love to do it. Advice. And a lot of your performances and things that you do, you raise money for different organizations. One, the Children's Miracle Network, right, in the past few years. Why have you picked them? Well, growing up and, and being in magic, everything was like a kid's birthday party starting out. Mm -hmm. So kids, kids always thinking about the kids. And kids at Christmas time really pulled at my heartstrings. So every year we go to Carillion's Children's Hospital and actually give back, go room to room doing magic tricks. Well, what would you say is the biggest one that you've done so far? As part of the Magic of Giving project? Yes. Uh, we got to produce a car for a lady in need. Uh, she was 28 years old <gasps> oh and uh, she had a nine-year-old daughter that had two heart transplants. And uh, Charity got a hold of me and said, hey, can we do something big for her? I'm like, yeah, let's That's do it. Cool. The coolest thing about this is that the memory is going to last longer than the car. Uh -huh. 30 years from now, that lady will never forget the day where that magician of made a car not. appear for her. <laughs> that she yes. got to keep. It was That's awesome. Yeah, absolutely. Awesome. So if people are wanting to support you and, of course, the cause that you're supporting, how can they get involved? How can they show support for you and for the, for the Children's Miracle Network? Just find me online, my website, uh, wesisley.com. There's a link to um, another TV show we do called The Magic, uh, Magic Life, Wes Isley's Magic Life, that follows my family around doing 400 shows a year. And then the other show that we do is called The Magic of Giving Project. Awesome. Cool. And we do want to fit in a trick or two if yeah. you have some time. Let's so do it. Let's, let's do put it. you on the spot. Okay, so this yeah. is what I got. I got a deck of cards somewhere in here. Sure. Now, this is a regular deck of cards I take with me on the road all the time. Mm -hmm. There's cards with signatures oh. in there. That card doesn't matter. <laughs> um, but you'll see cards with signatures. Sure. Okay? okay. So do me a favor. Pick any card you want. It might have signature on it. Go ahead, I'll pick one. Okay. Here we go. Do you I show it. people? Don't show it to okay. me, though. Can I show the camera? I'm going to give you a marker. I'm showing Here. the camera. I won't look at the camera. Ooh. This person <laughs> did it wrong, though. I want you to write your name really big and bold across the face of that card. You're right. Date, time, blue, red, Wait. I, okay. Write anything nice you want it. across right, the face it. of the... I'm not looking at the monitors. I'm looking over here. Just tell me when you're done. Okay. He, I promise he's not looking, guys. We are not... <laughs> there we go. All right. There it is. See it? Did you okay. show it to the cameras? Everybody got it? We yep. got it. Okay. Red side up on the table. I don't want to see the writing on the card. Perfect. Okay. Watch. There's your card. Mm -hmm. Now here's the weird thing. I don't know what your card is, okay. but I'm still going to try to find your card in a mixed up pack behind my back. Okay. Ooh, mixed up pack behind his back. Guys, we're complicating <laughs> this a little bit. And rhyming along the way. <laughs> okay. Behind Did his you back. pick this card? You didn't see the cards though when you picked it. Nope. Pick a black card or a red card? It was black. black. Uh, wait, wait, is it club or spade? Uh, wait. Neither. Neither. Oh, you picked the joker. That's why you gave me that look. Put it right there. Put your finger right there for me. Watch, I'll take your joker in half. Uh, what? Four guys? pieces. Do me a favor, sweetie. Hold on to that piece right I'm there. Gonna hold on to this now, piece. Now, she wrote it real big. You'd see a little bit of ink on that corner. One, right two, there. the three other pieces I folded up. All right. Now, watch. Do me a favor. Just lift your hand up and out of the way. Watch. Okay. Now one card looks a little different from the others. That was... Can, can you find it? Yeah, but that one's missing a corner. <gasps> Pull that piece out. You guys! What? No way! You guys! How did that work? I'm telling you, he is so <laughs> I have no idea. All right, well, Wes, if people want to see you perform live, where can they find out more information about the shows you have coming up? Our website, wesisley.com, has our schedule by the month. We do over 400 shows a year, so every month we update it. Awesome. Very and, of course, cool. people can find more information about your work with the Children's Miracle Network there. So check them out, guys, and thank you. Thank Thanks. you so much, guys.